Okay, oh, you hear her cry at me. So first we get some coffee, but then we have to, we have to feed this crying cat. She's so sad. She does this every morning, she just cries. I think, um, yeah. So we're gonna get some coffee and then, um, okay, hold on. Once I have this coffee in me, um, hopefully I will stop sounding like I'm 90 and looking like I can fix this hair. Right now I look like George Washington gone awry. No, I don't drink two cups of coffee. <laughs> I don't double fist coffee in the morning, although I probably should. Hi. Hi, babies. Hi, where are you? You just on your way? Okay. Hi, handsome. You waiting for your mom? Hi, baby. Waiting for your mom. Oh, I'm so cute. Let's see, where's everyone else? Babies. Babies. We got anybody in here? No? All right. They must be in here. Babies. Babies. Let's see if they're in here. It's so hard to see them. <laughs> there they are. There they is. Hi, the babies. What are you doing sleeping so good? Oh, look at the cuteness. I close your lid whenever you want to get up. Okay, I close your lid. Night night. So, um, first we're going to feed them this and then I will go around and clean up all the stuff that they've made a mess like the food and any other litter boxes that need to be cleaned out um we do that every morning okay so my ferrets eat Stella and Chewy's Duck Duck Goose I have tried the other flavors they don't typically really like those very much so they will eat them but they're not a fan they're not their favorite so Duck Duck Goose is the way they go the thing is, is that these are freeze dried. And so ideally you would want to hydrate this before giving it to your ferrets. Now I have tried to hydrate this and give this to the ferrets and they will not eat it. Um, they won't eat it at all. So I've also tried other varieties of freeze dried and they won't eat those either. So basically my ferrets eat this in its form that it comes in, which is probably not always recommended but the directions say that it can be done that way. It just says that if you're going to, so first it says that for every cup of food you add a half a cup of cool water or warm water. Um, however, it says that it can be fed dry, but if you do that, to please make sure that you're always giving them a lot of water. So if your ferret is one of those weirdos like mine who won't eat it wet, won't eat it as a frozen food, um, then make sure that you high, give them lots and lots and lots of water. If not, you're going to dehydrate them by not hydrating this food, and that is dangerous. So the ferrets also eat this. Um, it's Origin Cat and Kitten in combination with Ysom Epigen 90. I don't have the bag um, because I threw it away. <laughs> so they don't have that right now. But, I mean, they have it. They just don't have it in a bag. And then also for treats, somebody asked me the other day what I give them. Um, I use these, but it's strictly like it's a hundred percent liver and see if you see it says no additives or preservatives, legit strict chicken liver. And the reason that I have such a big container is because my dogs also eat this. Um, they really love this. I don't give this to the ferrets a lot, but when I, when they play with their game, their puzzle games, they, um, I use, this is what I use. Right little doodle. One, one, one. Okay. And then um, I keep two containers of water and two containers of food because I have four ferrets and um, this I clean all the time, but it's like permanently stained. <laughs> um, they like destroyed it. Uh oh. And then I get all the water bowls. So we just flip the waters. This this water goes here. Like here, what happens is they make a giant mess. Um, and so I have to come in every day and clean this. Now, once a week, I take these out and they get cleaned in the bathtub. Um, but that's basically what we do. And then 
then I have they poop on the floor. And then also the floor. So I clean the floor also like with a, with soap and water. That gets done um, every week too. And then like this, I normally just come in and try to pick up as much as I can. But like I said, these get emptied out all the time because I don't, um, like I clean their bedding at least once a week. It depends on how messy they got it. Um, definitely once a week, but sometimes more if it's bad. So now what I do is clean all the litter boxes. Next, we set So they'll play like this for probably an hour and a half or so. I just let them kind of play and then I go about my business or whatever it is I got to do. So like my crazy hair and um, I don't know, walk the dogs, make lunch, put on my makeup, you know, morning routine stuff. Right, you guys winter is upon us because now it's still dark and it's six freaking 40. we take them off the leash but um in the mornings especially with the deer it's just bad because they'll chase them you are my handsome boy wait you are my big orange handsome boy yeah hi good morning to your mom 
Say hi, everybody. This is my planted tank that's not so planted anymore. <laughs> Here. So now that that's done, I basically um, will start putting them back up. Okay, so now I am getting ready to go to work. All right. Hey guys, so I'm home from work. Now we're going to feed the fish. What are you doing, happy pants? What are you doing, little happy pants? Oh, I'm so happy. Oh, I'm so happy. What are you doing, old man? Hi. Hi. Hi, little babies. Do you miss me? Oh, hi, sleeping ham. Hi, sleeping boy. What are you doing like that? Hi, little sleepy baby. What are you doing? I'm so cute. What are you doing? Good morning. Good morning. Good afternoon. <laughs> it's not, it's evening. You ready play? Oh, you two are so sweet. You love your brother. You love your brother and your sissy. You love them babies. Oh, my little baby. Look how cute. Oh, bear, that is dramatic. Oh, bubblicious. Oh, my goodness. What are you two doing? He's so sweet. So, basically, so in the evening, we do the same thing. We all eat. We get up. We clean litter boxes. Mm, clean up any accidents that they had, which isn't all the time. But sometimes. Cage, what are you doing? Why don't you come see us? Come here, little duke book. Come here, little duke book. And then, um, that's about it. Are you doing it's hungry? Okay, here. And then they play for a while. Much longer in the evening than in the morning. Because I just have so much more time. Do you miss me all day? You, <laughs> you goofy goof. face in a slipper your eyes oh you little face in a slipper oh you see the face in the slipper oh gonna touch the little face in the slipper you gonna touch the little face in, in the slipper so that's basically my daily routine with the ferrets and then on the weekends we do a lot more things because i have a lot more time but yeah, and then a lot of times I will sew also at night, um, either while they're playing or after I put them up. So I go to bed stupid late, like it's ridiculous. But yeah, that's it. So thank you for coming along. What are you doing? Good morning. Good morning. Good afternoon. <laughs> it's, not, it's evening. You ready play? Oh, you two are so sweet. You love your brother. 
love your brother and your sissy. You love them babies. Oh, my little baby. Look how cute. Oh, bear, that is dramatic. Oh, bubblicious. Oh, my goodness. What are you two doing? He's so sweet.